Besmer gave his henchmen from the Daunt. Time to see what the Eclipse are up to. Eclipse. I we have to, to call this ruins. Hostile! One cut at a time! <laughs> Those machines look like they've been I don't think I'm going anywhere until I deal with these guys. Anything going on? There! That's all of them. Now, I need to get hey. into these ruins. I can help Stop you get in. whatever this Vesra is doing. Let's talk. It won't open from this side. It's got some kind of special lock. Clips, bastards. Good riddance! So, Vezra found an actual fortress to hole up in. Listen. If you're here to stop them, you could sneak in from the upper scaffold. We haven't reinforced all of the southern wall yet. Vezra's holed up on the other side of the pit. Who are you? And the others? I'm Yef. All of us are Utaru. The Eclipse have been prowling the borders of Plainsong, snatching up anyone they can. Would have worked me to death if you hadn't shown up. Any idea what's waiting for me inside? Eclipse goons, killer machines, dangerous weapons from the old ones. What kind of weapons? You think they'd tell me? I was lucky to go a day without a beating. The leader's always droning on about wielding the ancient power of death. <sighs> that sounds bad. You should probably head back- And miss my chance to deliver some payback? I want to help. Then stay here, and let me handle the fighting. If I rescue anyone else inside, they'll be grateful to see a friendly face. <laughs> well, luck be with you then. Guess I'll just sit back and enjoy the show. There have been some battle the old ones fought here.
The old ones fought hard here. Looks like this place is under siege. That's my way in. And soon, we will read our destiny. Quite an operation the Eclipse have here. Time to put an end to it. Who is I she? gotta let them out. Help Quick. us! Calm down, everyone. I'm gonna set you free. Blessed thanks! Free to conquer. Hang tight. I'll get you out of there. You're safe now. Get as far from here as you can. But what will you do? Clean up this mess. Alone? That's certain death! Sure. For the bad guys. All of you, find a place to hide while I finish this. Now, to take care of Vesra. of the old ones are mine alone to command and by mastering them i will secure our future maybe you should secure your hideout first ah. the savior of meridian how kind of you to deliver shut you. up vesra it's over hardly you may have driven us from the sundom but now is the time for revenge That Ravager isn't gonna make things easy. I gotta take it out, fast. Yeah. <laughs> 
wouldn't give to watch you die. You'd have to try a lot harder for that. Not with this. We'll both be gone in an instant. you just beat the snot out of these bastards, but this is beautiful. The others, I, I told them to hide, are, are they? Everyone's okay. They all found a safe place. I figure we'll camp out here until we get our strength back up. Then I'll take everyone back to Plainsong. Thanks, Yef. Listen, sometimes during his ramblings, Bezra mentioned his former comrades, said they'd arrive any day now. Are we safe? I don't know. But I intend to find out. It looks like Vezra spent some time in here. I'll take a look around. Find out if there's any more eclipse we need to worry about. Loyal eclipse. If you're seeing this, it means you've left the Sundom in search of something to follow. Your journey is almost over. Follow the sun beyond the gates of barren light. And bask in the gloom of future conquest. A new empire awaits. I've seen this before. I think that's the last of them. Focus might see something. Five tribes. Five bombs. That's what I need. With their capitals in ruins, they will have no choice but to submit to my rule. I'll say this for Vesra. He dreams big. I take them out first, which I did. Guess that's all I need to know. I should talk to Yef. Let him know what I found. What did you find? Vezra's comrades are dead. The Utaru have nothing to fear from the Eclipse anymore. And neither does the rest of the world. Well then. Can't imagine there's anything a scrawny forager like me could ever do for someone like you. But if you ever need a favor... You can find us in Plain Song. I hope you make it there. Some kind of outpost. With pens. That might be where Regal is keeping our machines. That was something. Ok. 
okay? Damn it! many machines. Where'd they all go? The drawbridge. Might be my way across. That's one half of the bridge. How to drop the other side? Looks like there are a couple of weak points. The rope's attached to the bridge. There. Bridge is down. That bristleback. It looks like it fell into a tunnel. So the rebels were keeping bristlebacks here. The machines fell into the tunnel, which must have collapsed as they ran further in. What if Olven's explosives created the sinkhole? I should head back to Chainscrape to let Javad know. Shall we speak? So, you've returned from the west. Any luck? The bristlebacks were being penned by Tanakh rebels on the other side of the mountains. Alvin's explosives opened up a sinkhole, dropping them into the tunnels. Which they followed to the mine and out into the daunt. Right. Aside from the rebels, if anyone is to blame for the bristlebacks, it's Alvin. Radiant beams of the sun. And all this time he was pointing the finger at us. <clears throat> Bring Alvin here. Petra, too. Summoned like a blasted ale winch. You best be meaning to put pen to part. What? Why is she here? I live here too, lug nut. <laughs> so what's this about? <clears throat> Thanks to the savior, the sun has shown the truth on the bristleback incursion. Tanakh rebels were keeping pens of machines on the other side of the mountains. A sinkhole swallowed them, releasing them into the underground tunnels that led east and out into the daunt. So it was an accident. But let us not forget that it was the Karja... I'm not done. The sinkhole only formed due to your unauthorized blasting in the southern mine, Ulvent. You are responsible for the machine rampage, the workers we lost, the destruction the bristlebacks caused, all of it. My dear magistrate, has your precious son baked your senses? I would never give such an order without first consulting you. <laughs> uh, evidence says otherwise. Aloy found the shipping manifest in the mine. You skirted the laws of the Sundom, Ulvent. All for a few extra shards. And you almost drowned your other miners. And sent that oversized tool over there to intimidate a bunch of refugees. I... I demand an official investigation. I won't be the victim of some Karja scheme. Certainly. We'll conduct a thorough inquest into everything. The bristlebacks, the mine, the refugees. Every business deal you ever put your name to. Well, that... That's not necessary, is it? What if I just return to the claim? <laughs> oh, well, that would save the Crown the cost. Of course. 
I'll be on my way as soon as I wrap up some previous commitments, tie up some loose ends. After all, the welfare of Chainscrape's people in a transition like this... Nope, you're leaving right now. Chainscrape will be just fine. You think she can run this scorched-out forge dump? Ha! Knock yourself out. Get out! Oh, don't want you! Bill. Don't need you! Down with all that! <laughs> 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 Me. Mud looks good on you, Alvind. <sighs> As the sun burns away, Shadow. Mm. Thank you for that, Aloy. Oh, he had it coming. Here, please accept this token of gratitude. You've done the Sundom and my sanity a great service. And I believe we have some matters to discuss. Guess we do. Not the most pleasant boots to fill, but I'll wear them. All thanks to you, Flame Hair. <sighs> okay. Chain scrape will be better off with Petra in charge. Hey. What happened here? What do what do you care? Don't you? As it happens? No. You know, I was already having a crappy day, and now these... These two idiots picked my shift to climb the damn mountain. Wouldn't be so bad if this one weren't so heavy. Wait. Two idiots? Did I stutter? Yeah, two. I heard another one shouting up top. Sounds like they got caught between sharp claws and a sharper fall. Someone's in trouble. Aren't you gonna do something? <laughs> Self-inflicted. And I got my hands full with this one. You're seriously not going to help. You seriously are? <sighs> Someone's in trouble at the top of the cliff. I better get to climbing. Are you hurt? I live. My so-called bodyguard. You see him on your way up? It was uh, hard to miss him. He's dead. Oh. Guess that's what I get for believing in the first chuff in the tavern who said he was a, a mountain-climbing machine hunter. Oh, at least I don't have to pay him now. What are you doing up here? That used to be a signal tower. The mechanism uses a special lens, which in some very specific circles is highly valuable. And since the Karja are planning on tearing them down, I was going to... liberate the lens before it got destroyed. You get it for me, 
and the lenses from the other towers, I'll make it very worth your while. I already found some, actually. Well, look at that! Looks like you're quite the opportunist too, eh? Let me take these off your hands, then. This should be a nice reward for your efforts. I'm an honest merchant, after all. Thank you. Aloy. Reyna. Well, Aloy, as soon as I'm up for it, I'll be going back to Baron Light to rest this ankle. But I'll stick around in case you want to get me that lens up this tower here. No pressure. Just saying. Promise it'll be worth it. I'll see what I can do. I can grab this from my stash later. up this place. One of the signal devices. Should be a lens I can grab for Reyna. Got the lens. I can trade it with Reyna the next time I see her. Did you find the lens? Maybe. If you're ready to trade. Ha! Let's deal! Here you go. Isn't that a sight? And here's a little something for your troubles. Now if you find any more of these, make sure to come find me at Baron Light. You got it. See you around. Huntress. So what do you want? Is there some sort of problem? The problem is foreigners. You're the second one I've seen today. Sooner you all go, the better this soil will be. Less chance of bad seeds taking root. I would have thought easing your land god's pain would have earned some goodwill around here, but... Ray is going to die anyway, just like all of us. Meanwhile, outlanders come taking what little we have left. Just like that Karja Huntress I saw earlier. All dressed up like a bird, dragging an Untaru girl behind her like a slave. Called the girl a thrush. Never heard that before. Must be some old Karja curse. Wait, a Karja Huntress with an Untaru thrush? What, am I talking to myself here? Yes. Saw them just today running southwest, likely to their deaths. Can't harvest the stinger fruit there. Too many machines. Poor Utaro girl, whoever she is. May her seeds find fertile soil. I know you didn't mean to, but you may have just helped me find an old friend. Thanks. Don't need your thanks. Don't want it. The 
Is that who I think it is? You see that, Milo? You have to wait for an opening. Care to join the hunt? Now the fun starts. Likewise. Come over here. Sunhawk Talana came Padish. Aloy despite the Nora. You're the slayer of Redma, the savior of Meridian. Milu is my new thrush. She joined the Hunter's Lodge shortly after the Battle of the Spire. She's heard a few stories about our hunts together. Stay and rest. Make sure you take some medicinal plants for that wound. So what brings you all the way out here? Are the machines back east too tame for you? Not quite. I'm looking for someone. A Karja hunter, about my age. Name's Amadis. He came out here on his own a while back and... now he's missing. I can help you find your friend. I know you must have your own reasons for being out this way. But I'd be glad to have your help. What was he doing out here? He lost someone close to him during the Red Raids. He was heading to the side of the battle to finally lay them to rest. Milu and I were on our way there now. The battlefield's near. I can still come with you. No. Go to Stone's Echo, heal, wait for me there, and think on today's lesson. But- You're no good distracted by pain, go. All hunters need to recover from time to time. Yes, Sunhawk. It's been an honor. Will she be okay on her own? Of course. She's my thrush. Come. The battle feels this way. This will be in my stash when I need it. So this battlefield, you said it was part of the Red Raids? The Battle of Burning Blooms. Amadis was part of the Karja army that pushed into the west. His division attacked the Tanakh, but they underestimated the enemy's forces. It was a massacre. I never thought you'd be friends with someone who participated in the Red Raids. Oh, don't worry, he was one of the good ones. He tried to stop the attack, but... It was too late. He's been on the run ever since. And you think something went wrong for him out here? Don't worry. I'll track him down. He promised he would get a message back to me. This is the field. Where the Tanakh slaughtered the Karja. Looks like time and weather have eroded most signs of battle. There are a lot of footprints. Must be recent. Let's take a look. Heavy footprints. Maybe Osram. It's too many to tell if Amadas is with them. I better look around. My focus might show me more. Amadis was supposed to be alone. Why were also around here? Hmm. Light Prince. Not Osiram, maybe Karja. 
Looks like there's a trail I can follow with my focus. Talana, I think I got something. Tracks that head away from the battlefield. Lead the way. I don't get it. Why would Amadis keep going west? Maybe there's something else around here? Looks pretty abandoned to me. The Notaru? What's he doing out here? Maybe he saw Amadis. Let's How ask him. Let me get Do not worry. I am not the Karja hitting kind. Just an old scavenger grateful for a little company. Name's Lel. You two must be lost. Actually, we're looking for someone. A Karja hunter. He would have been traveling alone, clothes would have been well worn. Yes, he was here, poking around the old battlefield. Wanted to know what happened. Lucky for him. Old Lel hears all the stories. Karja army. Charged straight into the waiting Tanakh. Most burned. But others, the Tanakh marched back west. Your man wanted to know where. Told him I've heard rumors of a place called the Rot. What is it? A Tanakh prison. Or a Karza graveyard, depending on how you look at it. Where is this place? Further west, in Tanakh territory, but that did not stop him. An Asaram caravan was camping out at the battlefield, about to head the same way. He joined them. They all went west, towards the ridge. Thanks, Lel. We have to get going. Good hunting out there. Let's head west to the ridge, then. If they find this caravan, maybe we'll find Amadis. Lead on. You mentioned Amadis lost someone close to him at the battle. Do you think the Tanakhs took them prisoner instead? To the rot? I don't know. Maybe. Bridge up ahead. It looks like there's a tunnel. A shell snapper. That hasn't seen us yet. What is that? Hawk and thrush, just like old times. Nice one, right where it hurts. to hunt by your side again. Come on, let's head into the tunnel. Oh, 
It's a dead end. Looks like a cave in. So what happened to the caravan? Let's look around. Maybe your Lana, second I think sight I found something. In the rubble. What is it? What does it say? He was part of the caravan that went through here. The note ends abruptly when the tunnel started to collapse, I guess. Oh. But there's nothing here about a Karja hunter. And an earlier caravan made it through before the collapse. Sounds like they went to a watering hole on the other side. So he could have made it. Is there another way through? <sighs> I don't know. These mountains are pretty steep. Then I'll have to find a way. Thank you, Aloy, for coming with me this far. But I've taken up enough of your time. Here, take this. May it help you on your own hunt. W hold on. How do I get in contact with you if I find a way across the mountains? I'll check in with Milu at Stone's Echo whenever I can. If you find a way, leave word with her. I will. Good luck. You too. Lana seems really worried about her friend. I wish there was more I could do, but I don't think there's a way past these mountains right now. What's that? The corp? So the rumors are true. You must be the soldier who took down Regala's champion, and the one who's got this place in an uproar. What's a Tanakh doing in Plainsong? Resupplying for a trip to the hunting grounds. You should come by, it's just northwest of here. That a sturdy soldier like yourself could handle the trials there. But I could. Maybe I'll see you there. Oh my. Please! The chorus won't meet with me. I don't know what else to do. How about you just start by telling me what's wrong? I'm from Riverhem, to the north. A few days back, I woke to the screams of my neighbors as Tanakh's rebels attacked. They were just scouts, but we barely drove them off. If a full raiding party comes next, we're not fighters. We're done for. I thought the chorus would help us. I thought we all sprouted from the same earth, but it seems an outlander is the only one who even listened to me. Would it be too much to hope that you'd stand with us in this fight? If I find myself up north, I'll check in on your people. I ask nothing more. When you reach the village, look for Q. He's heading up our defenses. All right. What's the most important task there? Oh, 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 those smiles for your families. The Tanakh understand only strength, and ours was a poor display at best. They will be back. You, the one who actually won this fight for us. A word. I want everyone fortifying the pass. Uh, your warriors seem... Green as early spring. There are children playing with sticks. It's all I can do to keep them alive. 
It'll only get harder. So far, the Rebels have sent mere scouts. But it won't be long till they return for an all-out assault. And if they bring machines with them, we'll need a lot more than eager hearts to win. You seem to know a lot about Tanakh's tactics. Back when the Tanakh clans pushed back the Karja Raiders, I joined the fight. The Tanakh taught you how to fight? More than that. They taught me how to work with metal. I'm probably the only Utoro who can. Never thought I'd be using what I learned then to fight against them now. We may speak freely here. So, what's the plan? The plan was making new weapons for my so-called fighters. I send my best climber, Voss, up the drum route to get the materials we need. Wide maws leave metal pods we use for crafting at its summit. But the derangement has made them as dangerous as the climb to reach them. Boss has yet to return. We have defenses to set up, and we are running out of time. If the Savior of Meridian is willing to lend us her strength a little longer, I believe you can get us what we need. You know who I am. Red hair, bow, fights better than ten warriors put together. You're well known. I understand what this place means to your people, but you're outnumbered and under-equipped. You can leave. Head to safety. Have you ever seen a flower so small and white? When it falls, it looks like snow in spring. My daughter called them Winter Song. She carried their seeds to the day she drew her last breath. Now those seeds grow in the grove at the heart of River Hem, planted by my own hands as do the ones of every brother and sister taken from us during the Red Raids. We, I, will not abandon them. Oh, if there's no convincing you to leave, I guess we're making some weapons. You have my thanks. There's no time to waste. Follow me. This way. With those paws and a whole lot of luck, we just might get out of this alive. Let's hope these sprouts can hold their ground against a squad of machines. I can only cover so much ground and my joints aren't what they used to be. Look to me like they chose to stay here as much as you did. It'll be the fight of their lives, that's for sure. Almost there. This is the best we can do to hide those who cannot fight. But if we fall, I can not take a you sooner than later. I'll get the pods your people need. Talks Don't worry. Fill the air to your How's the deal? Yeah. I missed you at both I need to find a way up there. Thank you. 
Almost there. <laughs> Made it. Time to find those white moths. There they are. Those pods they're ejecting. They must be the ones Q needs. Looks like I can just pick them up once they fall to the ground. I can get them with the machines of the moon right here. I should check the wide moss for parts. I got what you needed. Not a moment too soon. Did you find Voss? I brought his seed pouch back. I pray it'll be the last I bury. But now I need to get the weapons ready. Let's hope it'll be enough. It'll have to be.
Guess these young ones knew how to aim after all. Even so, we owe you this victory, Huntress. It wasn't my strategy or craft that got us here, Q. I just brought in some parts. Even so, I want you to have this. It did good by my people. It'll do good by you. I'll take good care of it. Be safe out there. Take care in the wilds, Huntress. Dangers abound. <laughs>